What is up guys, Michael Clark with BAM Weather. We've got a potentially significant outbreak of severe weather targeting a large portion of the country Sunday. I'm gonna give you a little information as to what we're seeing right now and kind of the idea on the main threats here for the day on Sunday. Timing's a little bit up in the air, but we're gonna take a look, let's, let's look. So right now, this is the area that we have in the enhanced risk for severe weather here on Sunday. A large section here of Western Tennessee, Kentucky, most of Indiana, Illinois, Eastern Missouri, and Arkansas. Inside this enhanced risk area, there is the potential for significant severe weather, and not to mention nearly 26 million people uh, in this area here for Sunday. I've got an area that I've kind of focused in on that I think we need to watch where there's some enhanced spin in the atmosphere in the warm sector of the storm system here as we get Sunday afternoon into Sunday evening. And we also need to take a look here at just the sheer amount of moisture that is available this is Sunday evening, dew point temperatures there in the mid to even upper 60s. The area of low pressure will be located up here further near Chicago. It would not shock me if there's a threat for some additional tornado activity on the north end of this as well, uh, near, closer to the warm front in the area of low pressure. These are the two areas I'm watching for at least the potential of a broken line of severe thunderstorms that are going to be capable of not only tornadoes, some strong, but the potential for very large hail and very strong winds along a broken line of thunderstorms. Right now, the idea for timing is difficult. We'll go over here to the GFS model. And again, th this is a, a, a tough situation to time out. You can see the area of low pressure here located across uh, Chicago. Okay, watch as we go forward here. You can see what the idea, this is Sunday 8, 9, 10, 11 o'clock at night. So it's a late night event for convection to fire up and the severe weather to get going. But possibly some really intense embedded supercell thunderstorms with this as the front moves through Sunday night into Monday. We, of course, will continue to keep you posted. It is possible right now this is a large scale outbreak of all different types of severe weather. Um, across the region and the potential here that if some instability can build and some of these storms can go single cellular if you will super cellular where they're in, in by themselves there could be some some strong tornadoes too uh, along with a very large hail risk so we're going to continue to keep you posted make sure you're following along here on our socials and if you want more expert commentary and consistent updates go to bamwx.com top right hand corner click that free trial no credit card required you can check out Clarity through this entire system over the weekend. We'll talk to you soon.